by 1664 or 1665, he'd made his key discoveries, the calculus and the binomial theorem. After that, he continued to work on those subjects and to develop them. One of the main things he did in the next few years was a very interesting piece of work called the classification of cubic curves. Uh, these are curves where if you write down the equation, you have a cube term in them. And you get rather beautiful shapes when you draw these curves, things like trefoils and cusps and so on. And there are a limited number of such curves, uh, 72 in all, I think, and Newton managed to discover and classify most of these. He missed a few, but not very many, and drew them very, very beautifully. Uh, as with many things that Newton did, he didn't really explain how he found them. That was left for other people to think about later and to discover.